Bennett is live at City Hall for us. And Courtney, what do we know about these threats and more importantly, who they're targeting? Mike and Stella, so what we found out from the mayor this afternoon is that these threats were made on social media and also in person to some city council members. The mayor telling us that these metal detectors have been installed and they cost the city of just under $10,000. There's two of them that the city had purchased. The city right now is being proactive and wants to make sure that council members feel safe when they are walking into chambers, which is on the third floor inside City Hall. Neely says some council members felt unsafe, which prompted the purchase. In addition to the metal detectors, there will also be more law enforcement at tomorrow's meeting. We now are staffing our council meetings with two police officers versus one. And when you think about, you know, having an extra patrol car or extra hands out there working, um, taking those assets off the streets uh, is, is always detrimental. The mayor saying that he wants council members and also the people who come to tomorrow's meeting to know that they have top level security. Again, if you plan to come to the council meeting tomorrow, you will walk through a metal detector before entering council chambers. For now, live in Flint, Courtney Bennett, Mid Michigan Now.